Anyway, Evans on to three, four for no wicket, actually. Next ball, beautifully steered in the offside. <laughs> going when they beat to Tunbridge Wells. And he's come down the wicket again, and uh, what a lovely on drive that is. That, I think, is going to go all the way. So, so the standard wicket keeping we've seen in this comp, well, in all the competitions I've been covering this season, has been absolutely superb. As uh, he just stood up there, Live Sport FM, or you can tweet us at, a, at NV Play Cricket. As Phil Stockton starts the uh, short mid offers come in for Jimmy Warrington in this ball. Well, if that's a deliberate tactic, and he's gone. Caught in the slips there, I think. Because he got the one at the end of the last ball. So it's uh, Evans facing now and very unceremoniously Paul Stockton. Off. But then Jesse gets to the umpire. Nice acceleration. Uh, so Haley does a cracking off drive there that uh, will it beat. Up to the wicket again. Warrington from the pavilion end. Turn around the corner by Haley and that's gone down now. That's out of our sight, but a couple of paces. Gives it a good tweak, but straight a little bit too much down the leg side and uh, steered round the corner by Evans. Who's Best Gillespie impersonation, front foot braced. Uh, and this time it's Haley who's got a hold of it. That uh, stride, couple of strides down the wicket. Haley's now opened his shoulders and he pumps it up and up. So that they've, they've got to work with here. And this Spencer is Hoyt to 10 years. And he comes again trundles in he's got a sort of Darren Stevens look about him and he's done it he has the skipper has produced a wicket caught behind still it's at the other end Griffiths to Evans uh, and oh umpire Jasmine Naeem raises a finger and that's under. he's back into the fray and Adam Ball Ooh. has gone he's uh, had a mm. he comes Skipper Doyle, and that one has been just crunched down to third man. They're looking for a second, but this is eighth over from the nursery end. And that one's uh, well, he strayed onto the leg side, and four overs, one for 14. So bowling from the pavilion end now, and uh, his first ball is uh, pulled onto the leg side. Pavilion end. There he goes. He's got us a real, quite a mechanical action. That, that one has gone. Down. Got uh, the intent and the firepower to do that. So Wardley, uh, the reverse sweep comes out this time, and Bexley, the ranks are cheering that one. They. So in he comes again. Can he rectify it? Yet? Oh, All right. That one has cleared the boundary. I think we're about to. English bulldog. In he comes there and walking down the wicket. Comes Aldred, and he has absolutely smacked him by the time. And that's the reverse sweep. He likes the reverse sweep. He plays it well, and he's played it again into what is the unguarded uh, Brings fine leg area. 50, I believe. Indeed, he moves to 50. Off 50. Answers. Better. Goes down the wicket to to uh, Wardley, and he's cleared the fielder there at mid-off. Comes, and he pumps it down there and, oh, and he, he's been absolutely wellied up and over and, you know, let's see, we don't know that uh, and the Doyle arms go up in disparate should, should have come back at all but I, I guess it's his job and he steps inside that one tell him that's manageable in comes Stockton and this time Aldred has, has used that up and under scoop shot shot Stockton will take the dot ball. On this occasion, he's given up for a very elegant shot. I think that uh, paid off in that case. Umpire doesn't want to take him on again. That's gone up in the air. There's two men converging on it, and one of them has got it, almost running into the other. So Doyle has do to uh, try and uh, keep the uh, scoring rate going, but it's actually Ben Aldred on strike. And, and Doyle having produced right here, and Aldred has lashed out there he's 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 hold out in the deep uh and that was a superb piece of uh First here goes stockton to freddie foster and he's been stumped the finger goes up and that was a very very smart piece drama about him doyle isn't he the food pitch delivery and riley has swung 
for six. Back to be the last over. Jones. Here he comes. Riley opened his shoulders and hit it straight down the ground, right towards the media centre, and it's. Uh, Ball. He's down the wicket. And I'm afraid Ray Doyle's innings has ended. One ball, he's edged it behind. I think he's just gunned you, Foster. That's another attempt to sweep. I think it's, it's a successful attempt because it's cleared the ropes. And uh, it's a period of play. Keith, over to you, sir. And we have another three times. So he plays the next ball, and that's uh, behind square, but he's going to race away, and I think that might well go to the boundary for four. He's raced on to 34, 46 for one. And he checks the shot again, and I think it's going to be another boundary. Punctuate this innings with some boundaries. And bowls. Oh, sorry, I was, I was distracted by the worm, and uh, finding his length a bit more now. Riley comes in bowls and that's played on the offside. So very used to this sort of role, which is what he's doing at the moment as he goes to pick the ball on the left side. He's been given LBW. He looks very disappointed at 87 and they're 61, so a little behind at the moment. But he goes to the big shot. He, I think he's got quite a liking for Freddie Foster. Have we got another from the knock dabbers? <laughs> And Robinson's gone That's for a big, six. big shot. I think that has... So Riley in then for the 16th over. And uh, that's off the outside edge of Staple. He's going to go racing away. Will that be his 50? As he goes down, he's, gone, he's just gone over the rope. And he has 50 for Marcus Stables. Probably a little bit full chewers. Of time at the moment. So I'll check it out in a moment as he bowls the next ball. And uh, Oh, oh my uh, word. There's a run out. A run out. feature. Riley starting a new over, which uh, is to Robinson, who uh, steers in quite nicely behind square, and I think that could be a boundary. As he's seven for three. Oh, lovely nice. shot. Which is purring away there because I think Adam Riley strayed slightly down the legs, and, and they should feel proud. I'm sure they do, Rich. And he's got him. Cheers. He thought he was running it down to third man. It actually squeezed itself out. Was it just above us? I think. Uh, Jazz Singh. Oh gosh, that he's absolutely launched that one. It's a real. Here comes Singh once again. Robinson's. Oh, he's really laced that through the offside of Lissom run of his, and he comes. And Robinson really oh. good. taken a liking to that. That's the straightest six I think we've had all day. It may be what Patel can do to dislodge him. Uh, he goes down with a four runs. front foot slog sweep uh, for four runs. Away from his 50 here, Another Robinson. Hand, he's he? got a slightly sort of gawky stance. And there's the blow that you were, you were calling for. Clattered into the boundary boards and takes Robinson to exactly 50 or 32. If you, you haven't committed them to memory, but uh, <laughs> never mind. They'll come up on the, on the screen. And there he goes again. He's swept again and swept hard. It's definitely the way that way Foster now. Oh, and he's, oh, he's clubbed that one. I would say that was a bit of a top edge, but <laughs> Freddie Foster from the pavilion end and uh, buys down the wicket. Four runs. And, uh, oh. and he comes for economical action, turns it over, and that's the reverse sweep. It's come out there, it's beaten the man on 45, uh, <laughs> and I think it's going to go all the way to the boundary. It's two, so very, very good. And that's the reverse. Dab sweep there, which has gone down the hill. I think it will evade everybody. It's run down the slope, past the pavilion, all the way through this game. Here comes uh, Paul. And Robinson has got a top edge on that one. It's flying up. There's a man underneath it. He's, he's cupped it Australian style. I think it's Anish Patel, who will be the t to Stockton. Left-handed Stockton. And he drives on the up and Got ball. Tries to reverse sweep and doesn't connect at all. And Stockton might be in trouble here. I yeah, think he's, he's out. Gone. He's gone. 
Stockton tried the reverse sweep, didn't middle it at all, had no intention of to them if it did. Sing comes in bowls. That's well hit there, and you're Super talking about bounded Rich off Tony's faith in him. Can he repay him as he bowls the next ball? Goes the big shot, is that high in the air? Will there be a catch at long on for the fielder? He's got it! Beautiful catch! The fielder a deep long on on the boundary. Had to watch it. He caught Singh coming in. Bowls the next ball by it. Smart says four. he found the gap. I think he has. He's found the gap and he's gone all the way over the boundary for four. 33 runs. One and a half and ball. And there Spencer, are. That's one of them. I think he's got hold of that one and he has carried. But not there at the moment. But chance for him to make their name. Uh, there's a bit of an edge there by Walden. That could be a valuable edge because he's racing away to the boundary and he's going to get there. It's four runs. A loose delivery. Comes again, Bowles. Oh, and he's go. cut away that one. And again, he's found the same gap and he's got another four. But anyway, let's watch as uh, Ball bowls the next ball. By it. Plays it onto the onside, but uh, just a single. Oh, there could be trouble here. Now he's got back in as. Uh, I think of Scott Wardley there. Extra pace, here he comes. Comes in again, bowl to Wardley. Ooh. Wardley, he's out, got behind. Went for the oh. big shot. Oh, so, experienced plow out there. there Goes go. to the first sleep, and I think he's got the four. I think that's... He has got the four. I think that may... 15 overs, let's stop that in a moment. Here, here comes the go. last ball, Evans bowls. Bart go down the wicket. He's not, he's not, he went straight back to Evans who runs out, Warrington, Bexley have won! Bexley win! Bexley have won! By it, didn't middle the ball, he drove it straight back to Evans. By the barest of margins, I think you'll find. Well, Warrington was backing up, I don't think it mattered anyway because they stopped the single. And by the barest of margins, Bexley have beaten Ambridge.